If you'd done as I said, he would have been neutralized already. I don't want neutralized. I want dead. Hope I'm not interrupting. What does he want? It's not what I want. It's what I can give you. Let's be straight, okay? It's obvious you're not some dumb schmuck up here to grab a few purses. Am I right? Are you very perceptive? Yeah, I, I want 60 minutes. I say to myself, these guys are professional, they're motivated, they're happening, I eat, they want something. Huh? Personally, I couldn't care less about your politics. Maybe you're pissed off with the camel jockeys, maybe it's the Hebes, Northern Isles. It's none of my business. I figure you're here to negotiate. Am I right? You're amazing. You've worked it all out already. <laughs> business is business. Use a gun, I use a fountain pen. What's the difference? Let's put it in my terms. You're here for a hostile takeover. You grab us for some green meal. You don't expect there to be a poison pill running around the building. Am I right? Hans? Booby? I'm your white knight. Sorry, I missed 60 minutes. What are you saying? Guy upstairs fucking things up, huh? I can give him to you. Are you there, cowboy? Or should I say, Mr. McLean? Mr. Officer John McLean of the New York Police Department. Sister Teresa called me Mr. McLean. My friends call me John. You're neither, shithead. I've got someone here who wants to talk to you. A special friend who is with you at the party here tonight. Hey, John boy. Ellis? Yeah. Now listen, John. They're giving me a few minutes to try and talk some sense into you. I know you think you're just doing your job, John, and I can appreciate that. Now look. No one gets out of here until these guys get to talk to the L.A. police. And that just ain't gonna happen. So you stop messing up the works, capiche? Ellis, what have you told them? I told them we were old friends and you my guest at the party. Ellis, you shouldn't be doing this. Tell me about it. Now listen to me, John. They want you to tell them where the death is. Yeah, I hear ya. Hey, John, I think you can get with the program in Atlanta, huh? The police are here now, it's their problem. Tell these guys where the detonators are so no one else gets hurt. You know, I'm putting my life on the line for you, pal. Ellis. Listen to me very carefully. John. Shut up, Ellis. Just shut your mouth. Put Hans back on the line. Hans, the shithead does not know what kind of man you are, but I do. Listen. Good. Then give us what we want and save your friend's life. You're not part of this equation, it's time you realize that. What am I, a method actor? Hans, babe, put away the gun. This is radio, not television. Hans, this asshole is not my friend, I just met him tonight. Jesus Christ, Ellis, these people are gonna kill you! Tell him you don't know me! <laughs> John, how could you say that after all these years, huh? John? John? Talk to me! Where are my detonators? Where are they? Or shall I shoot another one? Sooner or later I might reach someone you actually care about! Go fuck yourself, Hans. 